All right. Uh, new party members uh, with us. Jin. Yeah, this uh, this guy is uh, Xian's sis. Uh, Xian's a brother of yours. What do you call him, a sister? Because of his long hair. Is that it? Have a nice day. Uh, it really. I gotta be honest. Like, uh, I remember back in the day when I saw him. I thought something isn't right he definitely they didn't say they really didn't go out and say that he was a wimp but they definitely didn't showcase uh, de at least uh, from xian's uh, description of him that he really is just you know like uh, a lazy a like lazy ass but now he's uh he's a badass of some sort he's a badass of some sort uh yes. Yeah, all of these uh, new stuff viewers like, I really do not remember a lot of these uh, 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 skills and how to uh, use them and whatnot, but uh, uh, we're gonna have to explore all of that uh, much, much later. But we have uh, all of these characters have uh, certain skills. Uh, both of them definitely have the ability to heal, which is good. Uh, Mitika, a low HP recovery relative to other attack. Oh, it's gonna... it's gonna give as much health. Uh, depending on your other ability, which, which is something that's definitely not new. Clear L-type status effect based on caster's uh, other attack. Uh, both of them have the same abilities, pretty much. But uh, yeah, Jin is definitely uh, much more powerful than us. Uh, that's uh, that is uh, interesting. All right, viewers, let's go ahead and continue. Uh, I changed the uh, sound uh, levels for a little bit, viewers. I don't know if uh, I'm still trying to find the perfect. Uh, uh, sync of sound level. Uh, the thing is that uh, you actually have to go deep uh, a little bit. You cannot at certain uh, musical notes. Probably it's gonna be uh, gonna be a little bit higher in uh, some uh, areas than others. Uh, you know, I don't wanna. Break the chains that bind us. Break the what? Ashes to ashes. It's just, it's just a goddamn boulder, dude. <laughs> Chill out. Well, behind these boulders, we're gonna have a, a treasure chest containing Revive S. What does Revive S do? I should uh, be uh, checking all these items, especially the newer ones. Revives and recovers 25% of max HP. All right. Yeah, I'm still trying to find the, you know, the perfect uh, sound level. Musical tones uh, can be a little bit higher than uh, usual in some areas, so I'm still gonna have to try and find the consistent sound level. Uh, huh? oh, there's uh, an enemy. S I think that's an enemy. Uh, yeah, that's an enemy. <laughs> try to talk to him. Don't worry, we won't lose. I won't be uh, losing to these uh, chums. A new tutorial. I take it that this is your first time in a character-based battle. I will give you a simple explanation. Yeah, you can see viewers, uh, like, by the... Uh, if you guys are familiar with the first game, you can see that there are a, a change in the combat. If you guys remember correctly, uh, in the... In the previous game, you used to be able to choose an attack, and once you choose it, it's gonna be applied, uh, regardless of the combo that tr you're trying to to do. But here, it's gonna be a little bit different, uh, which is, you know, the uh, the thing that I talked about, that uh, thing that I didn't like about the combat, which is, you know, that you actually have to input the full combo before the character can actually, you know do it, which, you know, sometimes you just want to do a single attack to just see if, the, if uh, you know, if a physical attack or an other attack is gonna be effective against an enemy. You can no longer do that, sadly. But, uh, there are a few things that actually gonna help you. Uh, 
that's gonna help you, you know, uh, deal with that certain situation of actually knowing if the uh, enemy is gonna be susceptible to physical attacks or other attacks. Basic attacks. Take a look at the icons on the bottom left of the screen. The basic attacks are the consecutive attacks with the square and triangle, and the single attack with circle. The circle attacks usually uh, used to be attacks that are... Uh, uh, I really can't remember exactly. <laughs> like, they were, uh, at the very least, powerful. Uh, and you had to charge for them. Yeah, and you had to charge for them, but we'll, we'll see, we'll see how uh, the combat uh, here works. I gotta be honest with you viewers, I really cannot remember a lot of the uh, the changes in the combat line. I do remember uh, some of the things, I definitely remember the, one that, the ones that uh, annoyed me. <laughs> the information next to the attack icon indicates the attack characteristics. Finding the most effective attack characteristics for each enemy is the first step to obtain... Uh, to obtaining an advantage in battle. Attack characteristics can also be viewed in the tech menu. Uh, you can actually see at the tech menu, I think they mean the menu uh, to the right, having uh, the, uh, the the enemy's uh, name. You take Soldier A, if you can see it. HP 110, SC, Zone, question mark. Well, well, experience is uh, the best form of training, so let's give it a try. When attacking, keep your eyes out for the B and C signs on the left of the screen. Left of the screen? I don't see any uh, B and Cs on the left of the screen. What are they talking about? Uh, left of the screen? <laughs> I cannot see it. Let's just do a normal attack and see. Yeah, you can see. Once you do a select attack, I just selected attack with the with the square. Now I have to select the other attack. Ah, BB, huh? Uh, BB. I don't know uh, what that indicates. I thought this uh, enemy had 110. Oh, we killed him. I think we killed him, and uh, another one popped up. A BB. Is it, like, biological? I don't think that's uh, the case. Let's try triangle this time. Triangle, triangle. Ah, CC. Ah, you can see. B were, were reds. I think they're, that means that they were susceptible to to physical attacks, and I'm, I'm gonna assume that triangles are actually other. Although the icons do indicate that they are... All of them are physical? Now, as I said, I really can't remember a lot of these uh, uh, <laughs> changes in the in the game. Did you notice the B and C uh, displayed on the left of the of the screen? These are called zones and indicate the location, height where each attack hit. Uh, okay. Zones and attack buttons correspond as follows: A zone over three meter. Circle? I didn't try the circle. I should have tried it. A B zone, uh, one to three meters, square and circle, and C zone, under one meter, triangle and circle. So, circle covers uh, everything? Is that it? Some, character, uh, some characters are unable to attack the A zone. Interesting. Most enemies have a zone that is their weak point. When the zone indicator is shown in red during an attack, that is the enemy's weak point. Be careful, some enemies do not have weak zones. Alright. Uh, so... Huh, so I, I'm gonna assume that we're gonna... Yeah, okay, so that's the zone, the questionable question mark, which we can obtain, you know, by using some uh, some sort of uh, a uh, ability like Libra. I don't know what, uh, what it was called in this game. <laughs> I forgot the name of it. But we had an ability that uh, that allowed us to see the you know uh, the uh, characteristic uh, characteristics of a uh, the enemy. Break by continuously attacking the enemy's weak zone, you'll be able to break the enemy's guard. For instance, the Utex Soldier A uh, in front of you becomes vulnerable with 
a triangle, tri uh, uh, circle, square and square. BB attack. The enemy will usually recover from break in one turn, but by using boost, you will be able to maintain the break sta state for the next character. Oh. Okay, interesting. Air and down. Use a circle attack while the enemy is in the break state to air or down an enemy. Was there some sort of a combo system in this game? I really cannot remember, viewers. It is possible to maintain these states uh, for the next character by boosting again. Attack that have air and down icons on the bottom left of the screen are able to cause those states. Oh, so uh, doing the uh, circle attack will uh, allow me to down him. Uh, what's the point in doing that, though? Damage values. Attacking an enemy in these states will increase damage. Oh, that makes sense then. Break, 1.5. Air, 2 times. And down, 2 times. All right. I guess uh, we need to break them and uh, try and knock them down. Or knock them up. I'm gonna assume that some characters, or some enemies are gonna be resistant to that. But I'm gonna assume that the enemies can actually do <laughs> things like that to us. I don't know. Learning and taking advantage of enemies' weak zone to cause break, uh, to cause break air and down is a vital strategy in battle. This is the end of my explanation. I will max out the boost gauge, so give it a try. Alright, uh, thanks. Uh... Whoever you are, I think we can kill this guy. Uh, I guess I can do this. And uh, do this. Okay. That did it. But th this guy died. <laughs> you do and do. Uh, if, if I uh, extended the boost here, I would have uh, been able to actually continue attacking and doing double damage. That's the idea here. Alright. Nice suit. Uh, we got two medkits. I think um, these medkits are uh, new. Uh, so might as well check them out. Might as well check them out. You know, funnily enough, viewers... <laughs> Like, uh, I think I should mention this at least at the very start of every uh, s uh, playthrough of a game that uh, I record these sessions uh, maybe like uh, uh, like uh, 20 minutes or sometimes if I have uh, uh, the luxury of time probably 40 up to an hour uh, per session and uh, <laughs> this is actually my overall uh, second uh, session uh, so uh, I don't know I'm gonna try my best you know not to make uh, me actually <laughs> you know not to, to make people notice that I'm uh, actually starting a new session it's not that big of a deal but uh, I think it actually uh, helps me not to Break the uh, not to uh, you know play uh, you know, for longer sessions. I think um, it makes me a little bit... Uh, my commentary is gonna be a little bit refreshed, uh, I believe. It won't open from this side. Uh, uh-oh. How can I actually get there? Because we saw a treasure chest uh, down the, the path. But I guess we'll have to go uh, uh, the other way around. Are you telling me this is two and a half meter? Two and a half meter? Actually, yeah, that looks like it. Two and a half meter. Why would you... Why do you want to... Why wouldn't you make a bridge taller than that, though? Hmm. A new enemy? I guess a hero. They're not gonna give us anything new. No Whoa! Choice but to fight. Tank! Oh, uh, never mind. This is actually a new tutorial. I take it you're getting used to the battles. Now, let me explain the, uh, the menu commands to you. I mean, you didn't give me uh, any battle uh, before. <laughs> <laughs> After that other tutorial, but all right stock it increases your stock gauge by one like this 
Okay. Uh, yeah, that's definitely uh, not you. Uh, you can use a uh, stock to follow up basic attacks with extra attacks. Uh, the attacks, uh, the attack, uh, the stock gauge goes up by to three, so it's possible to perform a five hit attack like uh, square, triangle, circle, circle, circle. Okay, so I cannot burn a, s uh, a stock. Uh, like I cannot do a circle attack, which is a stock attack, without actually having a stock. Okay, and up to three. I cannot uh, have more than that. All right. Using stock to perform extra attacks will allow you to air or down the enemy uh, from break without using boosts. And double. Well, I know. The, the, double was... I think double is new, actually. Double attacks are special attacks performed by two uh, cooperating characters. Oh, okay. Currently, the command can't be used. Certain conditions must be met in order to use it. Interesting. Uh, they did give me a boost. Oh, I need to have someone to boo. I have to boost someone before I actually do that. Now it's selectable. It can be used when the current character and the boosted character have learned a double attack. Oh, they have to learn an attack. Oh, really? I definitely forgot that aspect of the game. I really did. Oh, well, it's not nothing. It's n nothing new though. Ice brand. It looks like we can use a double attack called ice brand, but in order to use the double attack, another condition has to be met. The number two is displayed to the right of the ice brand. This number uh, signifies stock cost and requires both characters to use that amount of stock. Also, I need to build two stocks. For uh, both characters for me to use that attack. Uh, in addition to having them boosted. Okay. These, uh, b having them boosted, I mean, these uh, certain characters that can do, uh, can use that ability. Got it, got it. Each double attack can only be used once per battle. There's only Captain Uzuki uh, and me right now. So Ice Band can only be used once. Um, is uh, Chaos is uh, the ones that... Actually teaching us? Alright. All right. Breaking the fourth wall here, uh, Chaos? Alright. I see you. I boosted during Captain Uzuki's turn, but the double attack can be used in the opposite situation as well. Now, if uh, Uzuki... Uh, uh, if Uzuki was the one that got boosted. Okay. Cool. That's the end of the explanation of battles. Uh, the rest is just practice. I'll max out the boost gauge and the stock gauge, so good luck. Yeah, you have the ability to do that, goddamn uh, uh, chaos. Single enemy, P slash ice, ice sword slashes the enemy. Let's go ahead and do it. Oh, I'm gonna do it on this fool. E2 Hauser. Oh! <laughs> oh, it's coming from the sky. Let's go. Oh, that's an overkill. Bitch! Oh, shit. This guy has a... What? what? This guy has a shotgun? This guy has a shotgun? Oh! This uh, soldier is different. I thought it was gonna be a BB. Uh, I think it's gonna be a CB. Alright, they're down. I see. Alright, that was easy. <laughs> that was a practice. Oh, there's a ladder here, I think. I don't think we'll have the ability to cross uh, this path, because uh, if you guys notice, it was uh, it was destroyed. I don't know if we will be able to jump. I don't think so. Well, we got a skill upgrade D over here. Uh... I don't know if I'm gonna have the ability to jump over. Probably have to find another way to go there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to do anything here. 
We cannot jump down here as well. So. Uh, this game is gonna have uh, something uh, uh, similar to the first game. Environmental stimulation where we can go back to previous uh, uh, areas and and pick up uh, whatever items we missed. Uh, we don't we don't we don't need to concern ourselves uh, ourselves that much with uh, missing items. Those who lack conviction. Uh, this guy is the shotgun guy. The shotgun guy, I think. We need to do boop boop. It's over. It's over. I don't need to do uh, an extra attack. These guys are gonna die immediately. Yeah. That was a fairly yeah, as I said, moment. viewers, I'm gonna showcase all these battles and uh, only in the s in the uh, the first area, and. Uh, with my, uh, you know, with the uh, with the way you, uh, the way I usually do things, I'm gonna edit out the battles that you know that are not important or aren't uh, are not new. Uh, do I actually need to destroy these? Yeah. Oh. What did that do? I have no idea. Yeah. I have no idea what that what <laughs> what that did. Well, all right. Are we gonna be able to, to destroy the this bridge? Do we want to do that? Oh, never mind. Maybe uh, they're gonna drop items for me. Well, acquired biosphere. Did I check with the biosphere? Do? Uh, no. Oh, we got also um, other pack S as well, viewers. It covers 25% of max EP. EP is the uh, magic. Uh, you know, is the mana point, mana pool. Other point, I think they're, they're calling in this game on or in this series. Biosphere recovers all HP and AP. Uh, I do need to be in a, in a save point, though, right? Maybe this is something different in this game. Yeah, maybe it's actually different in this game. Do I need to break this? Nope. Toys uh, Universe. Toys R Us? Well, I destroyed that. I don't know. Oh. Destroyed that uh, to be able to battle this guy. Sometimes it is wiser to retreat. Oops, bonus. Uh, all of them are B, so I'm gonna do uh, uh, low mid. Low mid. <laughs> Oh, they're gonna die. I don't need to burn. Uh... Oh, never mind. It is weird that. Uh... It's actually weird that uh... Jin didn't didn't kill him. I think because Jin actually have uh, uh, the better uh, better attack power. I believe I can double check on that. I think uh, Jin is actually uh, the better one here. I'm gonna go check on the tutorial here for later for these uh, skills, by the way. Which is uh, something that, uh, that's a good thing that they did that, because uh, in the previous game, uh, the game really never explained uh, these skills and tech uh, thoroughly. Uh... Which is uh, weird. Yeah, you can see strength. Jin has definitely better strength. Twenty-two against seventeen. Oh, we didn't check uh, Toys R Us. <laughs> well, I so guess we're gonna have to check it later. Exactly. It's all part of an attempt to make the Utic organization. Or should I say, all of Milsha, into a scapegoat. Even the Realian violence that we're seeing right now is nothing more than a brushstroke in the larger picture. But who's behind this? And why? Utic is undoubtedly a cover for a greater power, still operating in the shadows. 
I believe that this power is manipulating the conflict between the Federation and the Milshan system, driving a sequence of events in order to get their hands on something very specific. Like what? Also, 5G is the cause of coronavirus. Why data? <laughs> Why data? 5G uh, distribute. Why data? Why data signal to your brain? You need to wear a goddamn foil. All manner of data from all foil a hat. Aluminum foil hat. Gathered together within an area of space. And beyond that lies a special place only described in the Why data. Yeah, all of that sounds like conspiracy uh, theory, <laughs> like conspiracy theorists. What did you call him, Captain? Did he introduce himself like that? I don't know. Do we need to go there? Probably. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and backtrack, viewers. Go and check on that uh, area. Hopefully the enemy's not gonna respawn. <laughs> he is gonna respawn. New enemies? Those who lack conviction, not really. Please stand aside. I don't know. Uh, do we have uh, abilities that allows us to see the enemies? Uh, no. The answer is no. So it's gonna be CC? Okay. CC. Could have boosted. Nah, I could have boosted. You can accumulate boost point uh, uh, through. Uh, through uh, between battles, which is something that was never a thing uh, in the previous game. Which is uh, pretty cool. Which is pretty cool. Now you can only hear for a hundred. All right, interesting. Yeah. I thought it was dead. No. Uh, this guy is a uh, triangle spell. Ah, oh, this is, uh, was an A. Okay, it wasn't a B. I think I got a scrap of iron viewers, which is a new uh, a new item. I think it's a that's an item that we're gonna be uh, able to sell for money. Remains of a machine. Yeah. Some of these, uh, there's a lot of items that are gonna be, you know, trash loot. Something to sell. I'm gonna assume that we're not gonna be able to get here. Get inside. <laughs> Excuse me. The passcode has been changed from the inside. Please re-enter the key and confirm the code. Product delivery deliveries only. Unauthorized personnel prohibited. Toys Universe Product Management Division. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to go there. Is that why you skipped this uh, door? Have a nice day. Actually, no. <laughs> I didn't know this this uh, door is gonna be closed. But there is nothing uh, important that we're gonna miss here, by the way, viewers. So uh, if we actually didn't come back here, it's not gonna be it's not a, uh, it's not gonna be a big deal. There's gonna be a safe point here. I'm not gonna use it. Although, didn't they say that the save points heal you up? Yes, sir. No idea to actually touch them at the very least. I'm not gonna have to destroy these. Ooh, big explosions! Break the joint. 
break the chains that binds us? Ooh, damn, look at that uh, lady. Tits! Nice! Well, she's covering her tits. No cleavage, even. No belly button. Well, you can barely see the belly button. Oh! <laughs> Speaking of, uh... Here it is. You know, covered up women. You find the URTVs in the lowest level. All right. Captain Uzuki, thank you for bringing us this far. We'll take things from here. Of course. As I said, it was fate. I wish I could go with you further. However, it's imperative that I complete my work on this data. Uh, what's this? I want to completely expose the shadow behind this conflict and drag it into the light. To do this, I'll have to access the mainframe here. Also. What? Cool shot. Who did that? Oh shit! I recognize this guy. I gave you far too much credit, Uzuki. I thought you were smarter than this, a better thief. I never once thought you'd just come walking in through the front door. Well, I thought you might be getting lonely, Colonel. So I figured I'd come. Uh, why the hell is a uh... Hey, us uh, and his buddy weak. <laughs> Nothing happened to us. your ability to bluff have shown improvement. No matter. The data you possess is no threat to us. You've got nothing. Precisely why? I have some unfinished business here. I see. You know what this means. Who's okay? Uh, we be for boss battle viewers against uh, Margulis. Is that what his name in the first game? I actually forgot his name, by the way, viewers. <laughs> well, yeah, for boss fight time. First boss, uh, boss fight in this game. There's nothing really that we can do. It's uh, pretty easy. As the, uh, the game said, some enemies won't have any weak points uh, uh, at all, viewers. But I'm gonna try and explore. Yeah, he doesn't have any, uh, any weak points. Uh, if I go circle. It's a B. Interesting. We can go uh, all the way. Now he's. Uh... What? That was strange. So what was a? Uh... Was it a CB? Well, I guess it's a CB. I just noticed that. Uh, what the hell? What the hell does that do? Oh, he can do a lot of damage to me. 76, huh? He'll have the ability to boost. Oh, I guess. Might as well. Double the attack. Uh, boom, boom. No need to boost here. Uh, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Oh, 
Uh, oh, I managed to evade that. All right. That's cool. That's 80. Anti-break stance. Acquire resistance to physical attacks. Oh shit, I guess. <laughs> so we cannot uh, we cannot break him at this form? We cannot break him at this form? So I should steer away from actually trying to break him. Is that the idea here? Was he still in a broken uh, state? I think that's uh, what it is. Uh, I can use uh, my my double attacks, right? Fifty-one. It's okay. Mm. You know what? Might as well. Uh, oh, you don't. You cannot use ether. I thought you can use ether. Am I? I thought you can use ether chaos. Oh, well, never mind. No. Okay. It's not that big of a deal. No, only you, huh? I thought he... Chaos has the ability to use either, but never mind. I did boost. Why didn't why did it not go? If he's weakened, he's gonna stare up in the air. That's weird. <laughs> okay. Nice evasion. Yeah, I definitely missed my chance there of actually doing a double attack. Hmm. Break block. What did that, what did just happen just now? I don't know. Something happened. Seventy four. Holy. Well, he he de definitely doubled his attacks. <laughs> uh huh. Damn, I definitely need to heal. Do, 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 do. Oh, what does this one do? Ah, oh, clear L type. Nice. Like, I don't understand, uh the thing of me not actually trying to do uh, break attacks, uh, other than he is starting to resist it, which means that uh, uh, wasting stock is kind of pointless. Yeah, I would like to heal. I'd like to heal. Now. Up here. 37. Should have went for a. Uh, I can do this and do a double attack now. <laughs> the way he drops from the sky like that—it's 
it's just hilarious for me viewers. I don't know. Is it going to do a lot of damage? Is it actually going to be worth it? <gasps> 700 and... Yeah, he's dead. I think he's dead. What the shit? Did he do some, uh, like, uh, final attack before he, uh... Before he won? What do we got him, viewers? Well, we got uh, received revived DX. As, as uh, I like to call it. Revived DX! Oh, shit. He can fly. Oh, by the way, action scenes? Yeah, expect a lot of action scenes in this uh, game, by the way, viewers. <laughs> there's a lot, there's a, like, a, this game is action-y as hell. In terms of cutscenes, at the very least. the early 2000 viewers okay and uh, you know the matrix uh, was a little bit cool damn oh shit I thought the spiller is actually bigger than even with your so-called reinforcements. Pathetic. <laughs> yeah, we're kind of, we're kind of ass. Why, it's clear now that you never even had a chance. Uh, Captain, you're hurt. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, it's, uh, it's from earlier. It's nothing to worry about. If you'll pardon the cliche, it's... Just a scratch. Just a flesh wound. Uh -oh. huh. So it's begun. <clears throat> this planet is finished. There's no point in staying any longer. I think it's time we ended this. Once and for all. Oh shit, the music uh, is kicking in? <laughs> you dare to face me, maimed as you are? <laughs> the only thing you've mastered is the art of futility. You never know until you try, Colonel. That's enough! Oh shit, he's gonna shoot it like that? Uh oh. Ah! Oh shit. Uh, this is how he lost his eye, huh? Now you see your death. I have always been your better in every way, Uzuki. <laughs> it's something that old fool couldn't... Old fool? What the... Oh shit! Ah! I'm pretty sure this is a bridge and uh, there are two meter... It's a two meter fall down there. Oh, never mind! <laughs> Why is it not a two meter fall? I thought these bridges only to a uh, two and a half meter uh, high from the ground. Canaan. Not to say that <laughs> like a, a bridge collapsing that like that wouldn't kill anyone. <laughs> Is this? It's 
storing it with you is safer than carrying it around. Uh. Besides, there's somewhere else I must go. Really? What? Was that a, a good idea? Yes. Look, we're still mobile, Captain. You could come with us. <sighs> no. This is my own way of atonement. Atonement? I can't turn back now. But... Please, go on. Bring the truth of this conflict, the truth hidden in that data, to light. Please, do this one thing. For me. Captain Uzuki. I'm counting on you. So... Farewell. Uh, we don't have a ride, though. <laughs> Kanan, look at that. Huh? Oh, what is this? 